Hi guys, so I am on my way to Curly um, to get my 12s that I got put in on Saturday. Um, switched out for 10s. And that's because these 12s are loose. Um, they are, they swivel really, really easily. Wait a minute, let me turn the radio off. <laughs> um, they are, they have no, they give me no resistance whatsoever to turn them. Um, they have not gotten crusty. They are comfortable. I forget that they're there. So I think that we're gonna try and see if my ears will accept tens, which I think they will. I don't think that there'll be any um, resistance there. Well, a little bit of resistance because we're stretching, but you know, nothing to worry about, and it's gonna be perfectly safe. So um, I got a couple of questions about why I want to stretch. Um, they're my ears, <laughs> and. Um, I don't know I always liked it I've always wanted to do it for like literally like 10 years um, didn't think I had the balls to do it and when I was younger I used to wear a lot of dangly earrings a lot of heavy long earrings and I think as I've gotten older and my styles have evolved and my taste has evolved I've kind of gone away from that uh, not so interested in it anymore I kind of like the simplicity of just you know plugs and um, tunnels and um, yeah I you know when I cut my hair short I used to wear lots of heavy earrings lots of dangly earrings and then um, I kind of stopped I kind of like the, the clean lines of having the short hair which is kind of getting long now but the short hair um, and the small earrings or you know plugs just nothing dangling so that's why I want to do it and so yeah, come along with me and see um, what happens. That's Curly's husband. Down here. Curly's down there. <laughs> Next to Buddha. Yeah. I was, as I was doing this. <laughs> he looks cool. Are you videoing again? I'm videoing again. <laughs> I am the paparazzi. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I'd rather so, okay, so we'll go ten. a little bit further and then I'll come back out and we'll just put in the tent. Nobody here will go up there, so. Um, yeah, the jewelry I have in the eight is not just like from our own weight or something. It's not <laughs> something you really want to be no, walking around with. Not something I'd wear. <laughs> Look at the beautiful makeup. I know, right? Oh, what? Okay. oh, wait a minute. It's a marijuana leaf. <laughs> not that I have anything against weed, but you know. <laughs> but no, it's still good. But no. Yeah. Um, okay, so tell me about your pain level. I have a pretty good threshold, but you're good here. Sorry, a little bit. Yeah, it's pinching, but it's not not That's too bad. All we want is it's stinging. Pinch. Yeah, all we want is like a sting or a pinch. No said, tearing. Yeah. Um, you stretch your ears before or no? New. Okay. Aside from poking in that 14 gauge that I didn't know was a 14 gauge, right. and um, it felt a little bit like this, and then it was fine. <laughs> yeah, exactly. When I um just stretch my ears. I stretched them like, you know, 10 years ago when I was a teenager. Dipper. <laughs> <laughs> Complete with sound effects. <laughs> Those are special. I know, right? Feeling good? Yeah, it feels a little sore though. It's tight. Sore. I, can, I can feel it, but that's not so bad. Not yet. An ouch. <laughs> yeah, not, not yet. An, oh my god. Yeah, this here is easier. Yeah, that one's a, yeah. Taper in. But you're done, see? <laughs> it's a little red now. Feels it all, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but my lobes heal fast anyhow. My second, my third hole, sorry, am mm -hmm. I in both my lobes? Literally within a week was healed. Yeah. Done, like no problem. <laughs> see, that went in so easy yeah, as, exactly. as a yeah. comparison with that one. These earrings, if you can see, are internally threaded. So oh, awesome. I was actually going to ask you if they were internally threaded or not. Slightly different from the other ones. I was going to ask. A better, a better style of, yeah. um, of earring to have. I was, I was, in, I was researching that because of the, the librette that I want to get. Yeah. They were saying better to go internally you threaded. Did you send me the um, picture of? Yes, I think so. Maybe you sent me a picture of it. No, I sent you a picture of a pair of plugs that were cute. Okay, cool. Just like a, They're just like plain double flare plug mm -hmm. tunnel sorry 
But no, I was researching the librette and I knew that um, the internally threaded is, is much, much better than, yeah. than externally threaded. So yeah, this one does, I can't even, I can, I can even move that one. Like this one is probably already at an eight. <laughs> this yeah. one on the other hand is a little bit tight. It's moving though. It's moving. No dirty fingers on no your No dirty hair. fingers on my ears. I'll be a good girl. Okay, so it is the next day. Um, so I had my tens put in yesterday. Um, and please pardon the face and the lack of makeup, but I am so tired today. <laughs> And I have um, a sinus headache type thing. It's hay fever season coming on, so I feel kind of gross. But I just wanted to update. Um, they're fine, perfectly fine. Can you see? Um, and my hands are clean. I just washed them, and I'm about I'm about to put some olive oil on them. Um, but I did order uh, my holy butter. <laughs> I think that name is so funny. Holy butter, um, which is a an earlobe balm for when you're stretching um, and it's supposed to be one of the best um, on the market it's vegan um, yeah so they were a little bit sore yesterday which was to be expected um, it really didn't hurt I mean you feel it when it goes in but it didn't hurt it wasn't unbearable it was you know a little bit of a a pinch or a sting but it wasn't anything more than that um, there was no ripping or tearing or they didn't bleed. So far, they have not crusted at all. And this is the bitch ear, as you guys saw yesterday. This is the one that gives a little more trouble. And everyone has one that gives a little more trouble. Um, but as you can see, it's turning. Let me show you. It's actually turning really easily and painlessly um, now. Yesterday, it was a little... Go away here. Yesterday, it was a little bit stiffer or tighter but today it's fine. Um, again, there's been no crusting. Um, and of course, this ear is just fine. And not, this one is the easy one. This one I can't even feel. This one I can still feel a little bit when I turn the the horseshoe. But this one is fine. I can't. I can hardly feel it at all. Um, so I've been doing my sea salt soaks. Just you know, um, a half a teaspoon of sea salt. In like a shot glass of water or well it's supposed to be a cup of water then you can decant but warm water and um, hold it up to your ear kind of like that <laughs> it's a little awkward but I've been soaking it I soaked it last night and this morning and then I used a q-tip um, to roll the earring and, and get the sea salt inside the piercing which is where you want it and then um, I did wash it with a little bit of antibacterial my face wash but it's antibacterial um, and unscented and then washed it really really well and then I applied a little bit of olive oil last night and I'm about to go do that again uh, just until my holy butter arrives so yeah they're just fine they're perfect um, they were a little red this is my ear is red only now because I've been kind of holding it and it's not red because of the piercing so yeah I'm pretty pleased and I'm gonna keep these in I'm not gonna go back for another stretching for at least four weeks. You really should wait more like eight, but my ear, it, it depends on you. My ears heal really fast. Um, and so I'll just, I'll take, keep up, you know, play it by ear. That's the term I'm looking for. Um, and if, of course, when I go back to get them stretched again, it hurts or anything, then we'll stop and come back another day, give it another couple of weeks. But I'm going to wait at least four weeks and see how I feel. But right now I love them. And yeah, so that is my update. Thank you guys for watching. Of course, there's probably not going to be another stretching update for quite a while, <laughs> at least a month. Um, but I'll keep you guys posted. Bye.